what did um, drove you to Sunset Sound? Did someone tell you about this historic place, or did you had you been here before? We'd never been to Sunset. We've we passed it about, I mean, a million times. Yeah. yeah. Um, but our producer Eve, you know, when we were speaking about, you know, cutting this record, we were all very, um, we were all very determined to cut this album with live musicians in in a room, and not just live musicians isolated in, mm -hmm. you know, in moments, which is how we've done a lot of records in the past, but it was usually like having the drummer come in, we cut the drummer, then we cut the bassist, then we cut the, you know, guitarist. This was like having one whole band, everybody kind of working together and letting that energy kind of seep into the music. And there's only so many places that you can really do that in LA, where there's a large enough mm -hmm. cutting room, and with the kind of um, gear, the kind of board, you know, that, that Sunset Sound has, the, the boards, echo chambers. the echo chambers. <laughs> I mean, there's, there's just so, so, there's so many things that- Many that, magical pieces of this. Yeah, that this place has to offer. And when we really started talking about it, we were just like, well, maybe Sunset Sound is the spot. Let's just see if they're open. I know we're in a weird moment with this, you know, shut lockdown and um, hopefully, you know, they'll be down to have us in and we'll, you know, follow the guidelines with masks and everything as much as we possibly can and we'll get tested and everything. Um, and, and we were able to, to pull it off, which is kind of a miracle given this, mm -hmm. this moment in our history. It also felt right just based on who's recorded here. Like Allie and I grew up listening to the Beach Boys constantly and knowing Pet Sounds was done here and knowing we're in Jim Morrison's room. And we ended up actually cutting one of the main vocals on Pretty Places, one of the songs on the record, um, in this room, it was the anniversary of Jim Morrison's death. Oh, wow. And it was, it was so, so weird. We trippy were like, to be like, here oh. we are at Sunset Sound. We've passed this studio a million times. We love the artists who have come in and out of here. And we're literally in like Jim Morrison's room. Like it was really, it was, it was pretty amazing. And I do think things like that add a magic to the record that you just can't mm -hmm. get otherwise. Yeah. It's still for me when I come in here, it's just, um, you know, cause it looks like 1972 still mm -hmm. in here. It, does. it looks like 1968. It does. It's, it does. Uh, you know, and I'm sure you've been in other recording studios. I was just mentioning like there's hot tubs in these studios and gyms and <laughs> it's right. not a spa. It's not a Vegas lobby at Planet Hollywood. It's mm -hmm. uh, right. you're there to do music and it's, exactly the same as all these uh, great people that walked before you. So I think that's so important when you're in a studio that it's, you know, the music is the focus and mm -hmm. yeah. uh, we're not flashy. We didn't even have an Instagram page till a year and a half ago, but we were just hmm. stay busy because people know. Yeah, they know the history. Sound. That's enough yeah. to carry it. I mean, mm -hmm. it should be enough to carry it, but it's also great that the younger generation growing up can learn about the music that was made here and that the artists that they listen to now might mm -hmm. not ever exist if it wasn't for artists like Prince and the Beach Boys and, yeah. you know, Van Halen making the music that they made that then influenced those artists to create, yep. mm -hmm. you know, their own work. I hope that other people, you know, kind of take heed and notice like, oh, wow, the girls like took the time to figure out exactly where they wanted to record. It happened to be Sunset Sound. I want to cut a record there. You know what I mean? Yeah, like exactly. I want every artist that comes out of here, I hope that creates, you know, yeah. a, a chain a trickle reaction. down effect. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah. Yeah. 